The Advanced Technological Education Grant from the National Science Foundation is funding provided by the federal government. It'll allow us to strengthen agriculture education with hands-on demonstration and training. The grant focuses on multiple facets of influence. With the grant, we will be developing a precision agriculture workforce ladder through secondary, college, and incumbent worker education. It integrates emerging technologies and farm data. The grant aims to train high school instructors on in-depth concepts related to agriculture. The training better equips the instructors to teach five unique lessons to high school students, allowing those students the ability to learn about agriculture in the classroom and through hands-on training provided with the simulation trailer. In addition, the NSF grant offers college students the opportunity to apply simulated lab scenarios with their classroom lectures. Whether the students enrolled in ag electronics and hydraulics or data collection methodologies, the NSF grant and the simulation trailer provides first-hand familiarity to real-world challenges. And finally, Customized training can be implemented with businesses and industry to better skills, knowledge, and strategies with agricultural industry leaders and producers. Well, the Precision Ag Learning Simulator is a trailer that was outfitted by the National Science Foundation through a grant to uh, Northeast Community College. NSF funds also allowed us to purchase a compact utility tractor. This allows us to be able to power our planter and sprayer, allowing us to keep a real-world feel while still maintaining the portability that any portable learning center needs. It also contains a two-row planter that is completely precision activated. It has the ability to change population and hybrids or varieties on the go without any physical change to the planter itself. It also has a small scaled sprayer that has section control. We're able to use variable rate technology on it to change the rates of application. We're also able to change between two different mixes so that as we're moving through the field or the area that we're applying, it can change between mix A and mix B on the go. We have a Kubota RTV along with the compact utility tractor that are both equipped with GPS. This allows us to use them both in learning simulations, they both have auto steer capability that allows us to show the technology that is used in the real world to maintain straight lines and ensure proper coverage as they move through the field. We'll use soil moisture probes to help to train our industry so that they can make better use of irrigation and change our common practices so that we irrigate when we need and the amount that we need in order to save our natural resources. I also fully expect we'll be adding additional things as time goes on as the needs of the industry is more fully understood and as specified needs come to us. With help from the National Science Foundation, we've been able to outfit our Precision Ag trailer with the latest and greatest technology in precision agriculture. It allows innovative training to companies influencing the agriculture industry through customized training opportunities that are tailored to each company's needs. It introduces the passion for agriculture and innovative technology to faculty and students at the high school level and the college level. It provides hands-on training and collaboration outside of the classroom that fosters the connection with students and agriculture careers. The National Science Foundation grant is funding that allows us to do something that the ag industry really needs. It brings a lot of value to our classes because precision ag is becoming kind of the new norm within ag. There's no part of agriculture that is not touched by precision ag in some way, shape, or form. So when we're able to take all of our farm data and integrate that into all of our classes, it doesn't matter if it's a, an agronomy class, if it's an agribusiness class or a precision ag class, um, we're integrating that, that concept uh, through into everything that we do with our students.
The National Science Foundation grant has really helped this institution by allowing us to build this trailer. It gives the students a hands-on experience. The simulator will help in giving students more experience in different innovative technology. and It helps us understand what we're learning before we go out and apply it in the real world. Having the compact utility tractor will allow the students to be able to see the setup of monitors as well as the hydraulics and electronics on the tractor with a planter or a sprayer or other implement without having to go into a field experience. The Kubota RTV along with the compact utility tractor will allow our students to have a wider experience of hydraulics and electronics in the classroom. It allows them to be able to work in a lab experience within the classroom instead of having to go into a full lab environment. The GPS equipment along with AutoSteer allows precise data collection on our college farm. We have a two row precision planter. We will use this in a way that our students can have hands on experience in the classroom. We also have a small scaled sprayer that we can use in the same manner. The students will be able to see all the components and how they work, how they interrelate and we'll be able to more fully understand how those interrelations are important as they go out into their career. Yeah, there's tons of opportunities in ag, whether you're starting your own business, um, going back to the family farm, you can take a lot of ideas with you, or if you're going out into be an ag professional. A lot of opportunity out there with precision ag careers. One thing that I actually am kind of excited about, being able to take our farm data and being able to get it to other instructors that are not just precision ag instructors. I wholeheartedly believe that precision ag is the new norm. And when we have all these other classes and we're trying to make the connections between the soil science and the plant science and the agribusiness and, and all of those pieces and trying to really bring them together, that can't be done with just teaching, offering a precision ag class. Um, it needs to be integrated through all of our classes wherever it makes that connection so that we can just incorporate it wherever it applies not just say this is soil science and this is in a silo and this is precision ag and this is in a silo we need to bridge those together so that we can really graduate students that have a thorough understanding of how this all connects